This video, guys, is only for people that's got the Drone Link app, and especially for those guys that's got the Drone Link DJI app, because today's video is all about the setup for this. I'm all about the updating before you go out flying. Guys, it's always worth checking that everything's up to date because I did notice last time I did a, a Drone Link video, just before I went out, I thought I'd just check the Drone Link app itself and it needed updating. But it's been quite a few updates, especially on the Fly app, so at the moment on my Android tablet, I'm doing the DJI Fly app update. Uh, and what I will do next is turn on my Mini 3 Pro and my RCN2 as well, because I've got a feeling there's gonna be updates for those as well. Because it's pointless me just going out, um, I wanna do a Waypoints video, but this is the process. Okay, I'm just going to go through that now because it's asking for my settings. Um, allow permission. So I'm going to update that. Now looking at that, I've just seen the, the app update, which was, I think, 1.30. Okay, so I'm going to open it up just to make sure that we've got the up-to-date app. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to turn on the drone I'm going to turn on my RC controller. I'm just going to go into the DJI Fly app, even though I haven't put on the controller. <laughs> okay, so here we go. It's just telling me, uh, okay, okay. Uh, just the once. Okay, so that's gone straight in. It's saying that I've got the Mini 3 Pro detected, which is good. All right, so nothing's come on yet. So that probably means I've got to go into pairing it up. Okay, just going through that palaver now. <laughs> I can't believe the amount of times I've been swapping about with drones. I think I did do a, a Mini 3 Pro update, but not on the Android device even though that shouldn't make any difference. Um, and also my RCM1, I don't think I've done an update on that yet. So we're just pairing it up by pressing the button for four seconds. Right, so that should have paired it in. I'm just watching the, okay, so we're in. That's good. So we know they're connected. Now, here we go, just change the bone device um, because that's most important as well, guys. I think you get like four goes of flying, and if you don't bind it, then um, it won't let you fly it. So, always wait until that comes up as well. So, that's been done. So, what we're going to do now, we're going to go over to the about and just want to see. Right, so we've got the latest app update, uh, which is the, okay, 1.13.2, which is the latest one. I'm gonna do check for updates on the aircraft. Okay, firmware is, is up to date, which is good. Um, I'll just do safety data one here, just checking it. So that's up to date. Okay, everything else is good. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna go back, come out of this, shut this down a moment. I'm gonna go into my Drone Link DJI app. So we just shut everything down. Okay. There's always a procedure. If you don't get the procedure right, uh, this is where you get complications. <laughs> what they say so I can clear all that close that okay I'm going to turn back on the controller 
what I'm going to do now, I'm going to go into my DJI one, just the once. I'm going to turn on the drone. Okay, you can see already there's a, an update for that, which is 4.9.2. Okay. And without doing these updates, guys, you can't use the drone link app. So this is another most important thing. And what is to take you through? Okay, so we just go to download. Okay, select your drone. So we've got the Mini 3 Pro. More information not supported on, yeah, we all know that. Let's open it, just, um, it's taking me into my Spanish. Right, so it's downloading anyway. So I've just gone into my download file just to make sure it's downloading now with with my Android I I've got a is it an APK um, and it downloads it that way but I'll just see what happens because I'm still quite new to all this I'm not used to messing about in my Androids but <laughs> it with my iOS it, it we don't get this problem but anyway just the way it is so this oh it failed God, pretty typical, isn't it? Nothing's easy these days, is it? It's always, there's always little issues. And I know when I try using my Android tablet, I get a lot of issues. <laughs> uh, okay, so app is installed, so I could open that. So hopefully now I'm up to date. Okay, so there it is. Okay, now guys, what you can't do, you can't actually check your app on the drone link um, app itself. You, that's why I said you've got to go through the DJI app first and the Fly app first to make sure everything's up to date, and then you go in your drone link. And as I showed you, you can't fly your drone if the drone link app's not up to date. So, sorry about all the palaver of just going out flying this is the thing that i hate really but if you don't do this guys it, it's a waste of time you could go out we could go out flying and if that's not up on your screen that's because it hasn't been updated and you won't be able to fly so hope that's been helpful in my next video i'll be showing you the waypoints with um, a few extras because I just showed you waypoints basic I think over a month ago and the next waypoints is going to be a little bit more technical we'll be doing a bit of filming taking photographs different points of interest anyway look forward to that app I'll catch you again very soon mm -hmm.